Okay, there's no glue here. So what's actually making it stay up on the wall? Some people say it's static electricity. That can work for super light stuff like balloons or cling film. But the force from static is tiny, way too small to hold solid objects like this. Another idea is that friction heats the wall and melts the paint, gluing the objects in place. But that doesn't hold up either. The heat generated from sliding by hand is nowhere near enough to melt dry paint. You can even feel how little heat is made by rubbing your palms together. So here's what's really happening. When you slide the objects upward while pushing it into the wall, the tiny bumps on the wall's surface deform and flatten. That increases the real contact area between the object and the wall. So now there's more friction, enough to counteract gravity. That's why it works best on rough, bumpy walls like popcorn walls, where the paint can flex just enough for tiny bumps to grip. Mm, yeah, I wouldn't try this at home unless you don't mind a few scratch marks on your wall.